Over here is your sidebar. In the sidebar you will find your tools. You can manage your project and your floors. You'll find libraries with objects and information about your objects. Let's quickly go through the five sections. These sections I'll explain in more detail in other movies. If you click on the house icon, you will see the project details. In this section you can go back to your dashboard, if you're done with editing. Here you can rename your project, publish a project, collaborate with someone else, download the FML, floor planners file format. Here are your light settings. Also you can download the product list. The second icon gives access to the floor menu. This is where you can manage your floors and designs. A floor planner project is the main unit that we use for a house or another type of property, like an office. A project holds multiple floors and each floor can have several variants called designs. Upgrade your project to level 2 or higher to get multiple floors and designs. Oh, um, just a quick side note. The options that you see here in the project details are dependent on the level of your project. So level 2 will not show the publish options, but level 3 will. Collaborate is for every project. Download FML is for level 2 projects. Click on the hammer icon to find the build options. In this menu you'll find all the tools you need to draw your plan. You can draw rooms, draw walls, draw surfaces without walls, place doors and windows, place structural components like stairs and columns and also you can upload a background image that you can use to trace. So if you already have something like a sketch, a blueprint of your house in a different format, you can upload it here and then trace it in Floor Planner. The fourth icon gives you the information menu. Here you can apply room types to your rooms, you can add labels or text comments, you can place symbols and icons, you can draw lines and also draw dimension lines. The last icon is the decorate menu. In this menu you will find a color library, a library with materials, wood, carpet, stones, tiles, wallpapers and outdoor materials. Um, you'll find a furniture library, which has an enormous amount of objects. And finally you have an overview of all the objects and materials and colors that you used in this particular design. When you've selected a wall segment or something else in the work field, you'll get properties in the sidebar. For a wall you will get the materials of both sides, the thickness and some other stuff. That's about everything I can tell about the sidebar.